Hiya, welcome back to the channel. So as you can see before us, we have an E46, a somewhat lopsided E46. And that is because not only have I changed from the orange indicator, I've also changed the lens of this headlight. So if you look at that one, we can actually see through it. That one, that's good. So this video, well, I'm gonna do that side to match that side, and I'm gonna film it for your view and pleasure. So now we've got the bonnet up and we can make a start. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take that shitter off. And the way I do this is, if you look in there, there is a Phillips head screw, which needs to be undone. Now, you don't take it all the way, you just have to turn it a few turns and, well, make it looser than what it is. It should do. And then now, this should pull out. If you can grab all of it. Yes. And then we turn this in an anti-clockwise on. And then that is now removed. Next, I'm gonna remove this because this is also gonna be in our way and it's got clips variously along its length. And there's one down there as well, which I'm not gonna be able to film. Yes. And that leaves us with just this that needs to come off before we can actually remove the lens. Um, before I do that, I'm just going to check it's Angelo Singh with his eye go. Um, but yeah, this this is if it's going to go wrong, this is where it's going to go wrong. So let's try and do it. So first, I'm just going to gently put that in there and try and prise it apart in a loving manner, like so. And once that's released, we can just work our way along and pull it. Now this is also connected behind there, but. On the other side, I just pulled it off and it came off and then clipped it back in afterwards. So hopefully that'll work again. Yes. And it did in fact work for this side too. I'll just quickly mention that this clips into there and you can sort of, if it doesn't come out, you can, this is on the other side, but you can just do that and pull it. But anyway, now that is out of the way, we can take the lens off. And this is actually, yes, yeah, got a big crack in it. This is actually surprisingly easy. Unlike on like an E90 or an E39 or something like that, these aren't glued. They just, uh, they just clipped in. Now that is off, and we'll give it a quick wipe down. It should be a case of just pushing the new one into place. What you've got to be careful of is it make sure it's lined up to the seal all the way around because it does want to go on the wrong side of that little plastic lug there if you're not careful. And unless I've done something wrong, it really is that simple. So let's build the rest of it up. The next thing is, I'm going to put this back in. And this also just pushes into place, line the clips up, and it should just push in nice and flatly. And then this, if you line this up to the pipe, that also should clip in. I don't feel like it's gone in, but if you try and pull it out, it, it, has, it has gone in. Now if we look at these two, these are very similar apart from one's white and one's orange, but one's got a metal thing on there and I'm going to nick that and put it on the other one. I don't know if you need to do that, but I just think it'd be better with it on than not with it on. Yes. And this might be unbelievable that it started pissing down. So I want to try and get a move on with this. Let's put that back into the slots into where it goes and then we're just tightening this back up you won't believe this but when I did the other side the weather was all right I mean it was a little bit windy but it wasn't raining at least and it was bright and now I'm doing this it's obviously not like that and now for the final touches it's probably easy to put that on before you put the bottom one on because it's sort of in the way down there but it's, it's manageable it's not really a problem and that 
that's it we should be done yeah that is that is finished and i think that anybody with eyesight would agree that that is well, significantly better uh, i think we've finished just in time uh, so yeah don't forget to like comment subscribe all the usual shit and i'll see you next time